sa pag-ibig mo Pag-ibig mo lagi kang nasa puso't isip ko Isip ko at tinaamin ko na nami-miss kita Na nami-miss kita sa akin ikaw pa rin ang bibi ko Ang bibi ko kahit wala ka na sa piling ko Sa piling ko pang akong ipagdadasal pa rin kita Ipagdadasal pa rin kita Kasi di ko na matiis lang Welcome back, Nikinians! So we're back in it again with another video! I am Shay Volante I am Jessa Rodenas I am Shay Pauling So for today's video, we are going to talk about intercultural communication So before we go deeper with our topic What is intercultural communication? Intercultural communication is a form of communication between individuals or groups with different cultures by exchanging ideas and information by their communities. Basically, the purpose of our blog today is to have an interview with a few foreigner which will help us to identify which part of DMIS she is. That it will help us to discover and how will she react to cultural differences. We have Jackie Paras and Charles Kevin Sweetos to do the interview. program. Yeah. Why did you study here in LTE? I didn't choose. I just chose Philippines and then the organization with which I am here just do things for me. <laughs> yeah. What are the differences between your country and here in the Philippines? Well, uh, basically everything. <laughs> um, first, I think the climate is different. Like here it is so hot for me. In France it's cooler and I don't know everything like yeah. Why did you decide to study here in the Philippines? Because I wanted to go in a really different place. Like I mean I w I wanted to leave my country and live in an, a cultural exchange program and I chose like the most different countries I could choose because I wanted to see how it is in other places. Are you willing to stay here in the Philippines? No, I'm leaving this week. What do you think about us Filipinos? I think that people here are just so friendly and helpful and yeah, always willing to help and open to new people. I mean, in French, I, I think we are more close and not as easy to reach. Yeah. What adjustments did you make when you came to the Philippines? Um, first, I think also the climate because it was really hot for me and then of course, the language because I'm used to speak French and food. Yeah, I mean everything because everything is different here. But it was really a nice experience. So thank you. Thank you for. <laughs> As well, we have heard from Mario. We can easily identify that she is in acceptance stage of the We can see in her face that she is impressed of staying here in the Philippines, despite of having some difficulties. Differences in her country. You also mentioned that there's a lot of differences between France and in the Philippines. First is the temperature, because in the France, the temperature is way cooler than the Philippines. The second is the language, because she has difficulty adjusting her language because she speaks fluent in French. Despite of the differences or adjustment she told that she still appreciate our culture. She even chose Philippines to, to see different places and to know how it feels to stay in other places. She also described Filipinos as friendly and helpful, which is a common uh, impression of foreigners to add to us Filipinos. 
is at acceptance stage because she was not yet really familiar with us Filipinos or here in the Philippines. She accepted the differences and one of her purpose why she volunteered in exchange program is to know how it feels to be in other places and we are lucky that she chose Philippines. And that's all for today, Vikingians. Thank you for watching and see you again on our next vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and ring the notification bell for more updates. Thank you! What did she say? What you say? Mm, that you only meant well, well, cause you did. Mm, what you say? Mm, that it's all for the best, cause it is. I was so wrong, for so long, only trying to please myself. Girl, I was caught up in her lust, when I don't really want no one else. So, no, I know I should have treated you Forever. So let me in, let give me in. another chance another to really be your man Cause when the roof came in and the truth came out I just didn't know what to do